what other industries outside of sports do you gain inspiration from? Um, so like I mentioned before, I follow like a crazy amount of creators, like different agencies. Um, and it ranges from uh, brands like within the fashion industry. So from Prada to Adidas to Chrome Hearts to even Kith. Mm -hmm. And then on the other side of that, I also follow a lot of editors and directors uh, that work with big players in the music industry, like Jay Balvin and Bad Bunny and Travis Scott and Anderson Pack and a bunch of other people. But definitely, like between that, the fashion and music industry, uh, I do gain a lot of inspiration from from them. Um, I gain a lot of inspiration from really cool agencies. I one of my all time favorite agencies and brands that I follow is Laundry Service, and I think that some of the content that they produce is you know, like so creative, so unbelievably good. And they're honestly like my biggest inspiration when it comes to just like being in total awe of the type of content that these creators are able to make. Um, Cause they make content as, you know, advertisements for other brands, but it's still so unique and eye catching that it doesn't feel that way. You know, it feels like it's just fun, creative stuff. And that's honestly, I feel like what every creator aspires to be where you forget that there's, you know, like a hidden, you know, oh, buy this. We know when you make something because it's just that good. You don't even remember that, you know, that's there. So yeah, that's my favorite brand ever. Um, for me, I know that I get a lot of my other inspiration from the music industry, kind of like Ashley said, I love live music and attending concerts. So I follow a lot of people who make hype videos or recaps from like concerts and festivals. And so I use kind of a lot of what they do to see how they are using their transitions, um, how they're shooting, cause it's a live event, but it's different from sports, but it's still live and you still have a lot of people around. So I kind of like to look in that direction sometimes to see what, what's new and what they're doing and how I can incorporate it into the sports world. Yeah, I am currently working in student affairs for Virginia Tech. So I'm learning a lot about um, storytelling and um, enhancing stories of students and their experiences at Virginia, at Virginia Tech and how sometimes it's not always easy um, and they need to be real and honest and so we kind of have a platform where we can uh, showcase those voices and um, you know explain to new students coming in like it's not always going to be easy but we have resources for you so I feel like that can also be applied to sports in a lot of ways because you know think about our athletic departments they have so many resources for student athletes too that they might just not know about, or even people outside of that, the department might not know about, uh, like student athlete development, sports psychology, and things like that. So I'm learning more about um, how you can sort of market those resources through video, while also like genuinely helping people share their stories. I think music is a, is a big one for me as well. Um, music is a really big part of our office culture and our, our creative culture. Um, I remember like the little Uzi Vert album came out right when we got to Vegas for the Pac-12 tournament and before the first game me and my boss were like scrolling through like the album and like looking at all the lyrics to try and find good captions and, like one of the songs was Celebration Celebration Station and we're like oh that's perfect it's, it's great and so like finding different ways to incorporate the whole music culture into into what we're doing and, and a weird one that I, I don't hear a lot of the other people talk about a lot but I honestly get a lot of inspiration from video games um seeing like how they tell stories in video games and, and how um like these animators build these these beautiful scenes and, and taking that inspiration from from something that was built from the ground up and seeing like oh can i maybe do this style in real life um it just it it shows you what could be possible um so i think that's a another really interesting place that i try to pull inspiration from <laughs>